Bro, I got really sick, not gonna lie. It happens every year. Whenever winter arrives, I must get sick. And if I don't get sick, then, hmm, really suspicious. That's unusual. Anyways, ah, a couple of months ago, if you wanted to buy some memory sticks for your PC bolt, all you had to do and hear me out is go to Amazon, or an equivalent for that whatever service you use to get your PC ports, search for some beautiful Crosshair RGB memory stick, 16 or 32 DDR4, DDR5, order the thing, wait for it to arrive, so once it does arrive, pick it up, unbox, put it on your PC. Absolute cinema. Now, if you want to do the exact same thing today, that's what you gotta do. First of all, you gotta sell your car, sell your house, sell your pets. I know, that thing is cute, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Sell the PC world you're buying the memory stick for, and finally, sell your your clothes if you can. I don't think you need any clothes. You can walk naked in the streets. All of this just for a single memory stick, my boy. One single memory stick. DDR4. Not even DDR5. DDR4, my boy. I know it's crazy, but it happens. We had the exact same thing back in 2011 when that tsunami hit somewhere in Thailand and caused a big gap in the markets, making hard drives go up the roof. Lasted for a year or so, then it was over. Again, with the GPUs back in 2017, I believe, 2018, I don't remember. Back when GPU crypto mining was a thing, you know, the vibe. They bought a big amount of GPUs, causing another big gap in the markets. And bada boom, bada boom, GPUs going up the sky. Lasted for a little bit of time, then we never seen that ever again. GPUs went back to defaults with their prices. And now in 2025, and uh, this one is a crazy one, but one of the most important component in a PC world is going up the roof. It's not the GPU, it's not the hard drive, it's nothing else but memory six. DDR4 or DDR5 or high bandwidth memory, HBM. Three of those, let me tell you. The prices are unbelievable, and you cannot stand a chance anymore. If you want to buy one of those, let me tell you, you must get your pockets empty. Now, it's not really the end of the world. You know, it's expected for this shortage to be over in a year or maximum two years. It's not going to be forever. We all know. But for now, if you're interested in building a PC, then good luck. That, that's all I will say. Good luck. Good luck. I took a look at the prices for memory currently. And let me tell you, a single memory stick is the cost of my whole PC build. What the <laughs> <f> <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I built my PC for like 400 bucks. Go to Amazon, a Crosshair memory stick can reach up to 400 bucks or like 300. I think it reached 300 or 350 for like a single 16 gigs DDR5 with a little bit of RGB on it, of course. Yeah, it's crazy. But for me, it's not really the end of the world because there's solutions. Every problem have a solution. So what can you do? Are you ready? It's an easy one, I promise you. So solution number one, basically waiting. Are you patient? Are you really that patient? If you're not, then I'm sorry, this one isn't gonna work for you. Because as I said, this thing is not gonna last forever. But if you're in a hurry and you want them so bad, then you can get them for double their prices. I'm talking about memory six. So solution number one doesn't work for you. You can go to solution number two. And I know this one gonna make you mad, but hey, consoles can save you from emptying your pockets. In case you're not a millionaire, billionaire, bazillionaire, and you don't have five trillion billion dollars in, in your f***ing pockets, then a console will definitely save you. I know you might not like it, but hear me out. Console is not bad as you might think. If you're interested in gaming, then let me tell you, this is a game changer. PS5, for example, comes with a price tag of 400 bucks. I don't know how much they go for. I could make a little research and oh yeah, just give me a minute, actually. Can I go to Facebook Marketplace real quick? I'm so lazy. I actually just closed this. I'm just search it on my phone. PS5, brand new price, whatever. Let's just, uh-huh, they go for around 500 and the PS5 Pro is 7. Okay, okay. Oh, actually, so it's between 500 and 700 dollars for that price you could get a pair of memory sticks or just a single memory stick ddr5 
16 or 32. So instead of buying memory 6 for that price, he could go with a PS5. Not a bad deal. But it's a deal breaker if you're interested in doing other stuff like video that's in and, you know, whatever you do with your PC, then a PS5 is now for you. The third solution, there is actually a third solution. You know what it is? Let me tell you, it's a silly one. But it's called wait until Evolve releases the Steam machine and buy that thing. I'm sure it's gonna be well priced and yes it's silly I know I know I, I talked bad about the same machine before but here I am regretting what I said I think this one might be interesting if it's gonna be affordable first of all and if it's gonna be well priced as I said then you might want to consider that in a couple months they will be releasing their new Steam machine and I'm talking about Wolf and again it comes with 16 gigs enough for most uh tasks like gaming video editing and all of that and uh, basically a console slash pc which can do both you know console things and pc things not a bad deal after all but it's still no release so we know nothing about it but once it's released then hey if it's around 700 bucks not bad they say it can do 4k gaming which is kind of impossible it's just an advertisement after all it's not real the reality is much different and yeah that's that's all you can do for now really in my opinion i think waiting is the best decision you will take currently because most of us regret buying stuff for double the price later on when the short season is over so why buy them now and regret later so wait i guess that was just my opinion as i said and yours might be different, so leave a comment and tell us what you think and what you should do and what you should consider right now if you wanna build a PC. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.